Fabio passed away two months ago in October. Nine months after he was diagnosed. We spent every New Year's Eve together since we met. I was, I was really hoping he was going to make it to this one. I called his parents uh, after he died. I didn't want anything to do with him. He really wanted to be buried in Ohio, where he was born. I wasn't even able to do that for him. I've lost so many friends. I've been to six funerals this year. I feel like I'm in his fucking mind. Leo left me his chihuahua. It breaks my heart a little bit when he looks at me funny. He's still wondering where Leo is. And, uh, my job at the agency lost that. Someone might have found out, I don't know. And uh, working at a restaurant, barely getting by. I spent all my money on Christmas gifts. I can't believe it took you this long to tell me. Did you really think that I wasn't going to be cool with that? Yeah. I guess, Raven, you don't really know me either. Promise me something. When you get sick, you have to call me, OK? You don't want to be anywhere near this. Trust me. This it's going to get really ugly. I shouldn't have kissed you if something happened to you. Stop it. OK, stop it. You're being paranoid. OK? I'm going to see you next Christmas. We're going to go out. We're going to have a good time. And who knows? There might be a cure by then. There could be new drugs, new treatments. You're not going to make it that long. You're so healthy. OK, you don't even look sick to me. You don't have to say yes to this. But in the future, would you tell Andrew what really happened to me? Please. <laughs> 